a very good morning to all today we are going to start with another topic in max that is about 3d shapes so in the last class what did we learn we learned about 2d shapes so which are the different shapes that we learned we learned about square rectangle triangle circle oval and i ask you to go around your house and look out the different shapes i hope you have done that so now let's move on to the next topic that is about 3d shapes so let's start with the first one you know what shape is this so this shape is cube and which is the first shape that we learned in uh, in the last class in the 2d shape we learned about square so do you all remember square so it has four equal sides so the 3d shape of a square is the cube so a square has four sides but a cube has six faces so you can see this is a cube okay and you can have it has six faces so 1 2 3 4 5 6 so this is a cube and the cube has six faces so the 3d shape of a square is the cube and have you seen the dice or rubik's cube it is in the shape of a it is cubical shape with six faces so that is about the shape cube and what about the shape have you seen the shape anywhere what about your pencil box you all have a pencil box right so what shape is that it is in cuboid it is a cuboid shape so this is cuboid and it also have six face 1 2 3 4 5 6 so this is a cuboid and it has six faces so the 3d shape of a rectangle is the cuboid so we learned rectangle right so rectangle has four sides with two longer sides and two shorter sides so the 3d shape of a rectangle is the cuboid and the cuboid has how many face six face and the next shape the next one is the sphere which is fully round in shape we learned circle right so the 3d shape of circle is the sphere you all have seen bowl right so what is the shape of that bowl that bowl is sphere it is spherical in shape what about the next one have you seen the shape anywhere and this shape is the cylinder so you can see a cylinder here and you can see a circle on the top and circle on the bottom and two lines joining the end and that is the cylinder have you seen battery if you have seen battery you can see a, a circle on top a circle on the bottom and the lines joining both the ends so have you seen the cold drink can that is also cylindrical in shape so there are many objects which are cylindrical in shape what is this shape this is cone and you can see a circle down here and you can see a triangle shape over here and this shape is cone have you seen this ice cream cone you can see this round shape here and the triangular shape here so this is a cone and next let's see what is this rolling and sliding what all things can roll or what are things can slide let me give you some example so let's take a ball okay we are taking a ball and we place it on the table so what happens it starts rolling it starts rolling down the table why because it is round in shape so things which are round in shape will roll let's give you another example suppose you place a book a book on your table what happens will it move when you push it it will slide right will it roll no it will slide so things which are flat things which are flat will slide 
again give you an example what about a scale we keep a scale on the table will it slide or roll when we push it it will slide but it won't roll because it has a flat surface so things which are round can roll things which are flat can slide what about an orange if we keep an orange on the table will it roll when we move it will it roll or slide it will roll what is the shape of an orange it is round in shape so things which are round will roll and things which are have a flat surface will slide coming to the textbook page number 75 you can see the shapes so we learned about 3d shapes right we learned about cube we learned about cuboid we learned about cone cylinder spear so here you can see the objects given and you have to match it with the correct shape so which is the first shape is given it is cube so from this you have to find the object which is in the shape of a cube so let's see the first one is this a shape of a cube no you can see a round here and round at the bottom so can you see which shape is this this is cylindrical in shape so i i told you that a can a can is in cylindrical shape and what about this shape you can see a triangular shape here and at the bottom a circle so what shape is this it is a cone and what about this shape you can see the picture of a rubik's cube so the word itself says it is a cube so this is the correct object that match with this shape so you can tick it fine what about the second one which shape is this this is spear and you have to look for an object which is spherical in shape what about the first one so picture of a earth so what shape is that it is spherical in shape it is fully round in shape so what is the answer the answer is the first one done moving on to the next one which shape is this cuboid with six faces and you have to look for the object that is with the same shape so which one you can say is this in the same shape no what about this no what about this shape is this of the same shape yes this is cuboid in shape coming to the next one which shape is this can you identify which shape is this a triangle here and at the down you can see a circle and which shape is this this is cone and you have to find a shape an object with conical shape which one you can see the ice cream a round shape here and a triangle shape here so which shape is this this is cone and what about the next last one cylinder you can see a round shape on the top circle on the bottom and two lines joining the end and you have to look for an object which is in cylindrical shape so is this a cylindrical shape is tomato tomato is in cylindrical shape no what about this tent no and what about this you can see a round shape here a round shape here and a two line joining the end so this is this box is the answer so these are some 2d shapes even you can see many things which is around you which is of 3d shapes your pencil box etc your pencil box birthday hat birthday hat is a 3d shape you know which shape is that that is conical in shape coming to the next exercise page number 76 so here all these are 2d shapes so which are the 2d shapes that we learned triangle square circle rectangle and oval and you can see different objects here and what you have to do you have to match the correct shape with its objects fine so which is the first shape triangle how many sides are there three sides how many corners are there three corners so from this object you have to find the triangle so you can see this is not a triangular shape what about this tomato this is also not a triangular shape and what about this so this is triangular shape when it is 2d when this is a 2d shape and this birthday hat is in triangular shape 
and when it is in 3D, 3D shape we can call it as a cone. Fine. Coming to the next one, which shape is this? This is square and you have to look for an object which is, which is in this square shape. What about this board? Is this square shape? Does it have four sides? It has one, two, three, four, four sides which are equal. So this is the object. So you have to draw a square over here. Fine. It is not a square shape. This is also not in a square shape. Which is this shape? Circle. And you have to look for a thing. You have to look for an object which is in the shape of a circle. Is this a shape of a circle? No. What about this cloak? What shape is that? It is circular in shape. So you can draw a circle along that. Fine. What about this shape? Rectangle. How many sides are there for rectangle? Four sides. Two long sides, two short sides. And you have to look for a rectangular shape. So is this a rectangular shape? No. What about this pumpkin? No. And this one is in rectangular shape. Which is the last one? It is oval. And you have to look for an object which is in oval shape. What about egg? You all are familiar, right? So what is the shape of the egg? It is oval in shape. So you can draw a oval. Then this is the answer. So this is how we can identify different shapes with its objects.